<clears throat> Hello everyone. In this video, I will tell you about what is a motor point and the motor points of the upper limb and the lower limb. Okay, now talking about the definition of a motor point. A uh, motor point has two different definitions. Uh, first one is the medical definition, and the second one is the electrophysiological definition. Talking about the medical definition, a motor point is a small area on a muscle. at which a minimum amount of electrical stimulation will cause a muscle to contract talking about the electrophysiological definition a motor point is that point of a muscle with the highest excitability motor point can also be defined as the point at which a motor nerve enters the muscle uh, i will now show you the pictures and location of the motor points of the upper and the lower limb Uh, motor points are generally located uh, in the muscle belly and uh, to need uh, to know about the location of the uh, motor point first you need to memorize about the name of the muscle okay now you can see here the motor points of the anterior aspect of the right arm uh, first of all there are the fibers of the deltoid the anterior fibers and the middle fibers which have the motor points located here and here the posterior fibers of the deltoid will have motor points on the posterior aspect of the arm then there is the pectoralis major muscle which has a motor point here then the coracobrachialis the bicep brachii muscle uh, has a muscle a uh, motor point uh, here then the brachialis muscle brachioradialis muscle then talking about the forearm complex forearm complex have the following motor points Here is the motor point of a pronator teres, the flexor carpi radialis, flexor carpi ulnaris, palmaris longus, the flexor digitorum profundus, flexor digitorum superficialis, and the pollicis longus and the digitorum superficialis. Uh, you can see here the motor about uh, location of motor points. Most of the motor points lie in the belly of the muscle. This is the bicep muscle, the brachialis muscle, the flexor carpi radialis ulnaris. and the flexor digitorum superficialis to memorize the motor points of uh, any limb first you know about first you should know about the muscles of that region then there it will be easier for you to memorize them um more muscle uh, motor points uh, are i have told you that there are small area on a muscle uh, that can be stimulated Uh, with the minimum amount of electrical stimulation so if we want to have a contraction of uh, any muscle uh, we should target its motor points so that we can achieve the maximum contraction okay now i will tell you about the motor points of the lower limb okay these uh, these are the motor points on the anterior aspect of leg again to memorize uh, about the motor points first you should know about the muscles of uh, that region talking about the motor points of the thigh the first motor point is the rectus femoris which lies here the vastus lateralis and the vastus medialis then talking about the leg region the first uh, motor point is the tibialis anterior then there are these lateral uh, motor points which are the peroneus longus the extensor digitorum longus the peroneus brevis the extensor digitorum brevis and the extensor hallucis longus you can see also here all these muscle points lie in the belly of the muscle so if we have to stimulate these motor points or uh, we have to attain the maximum effect of the muscle uh, any of the muscle to achieve its function we have to stimulate the particular uh, motor area so that uh, we can have maximum contraction or we can achieve our desired result again i will repeat the motor point uh, of the thigh lies here the rectus femoris vastus lateralis vastus medialis tibialis anterior the peroneus longus the extensor digitorum longus peroneus brevis extensor digitorum brevis and the extensor hallucis longus